Hello, everyone. My name is An Yi. Welcome to my hometown, Sichuan, the land of plenty. Apart from the beautiful scenery, the temptation of a city also lies in its food that satisfies your taste buds. Chengdu is listed by the United Nations as a city of gastronomy. Local cuisine boasts a long history and spicy, delicious taste. Pixian broad bean paste is considered the unique soul of sautéed sliced pork with pepper and chili. Indeed, it is an indispensable condiment for Sichuan cuisine. A variety of snacks of local flavor can be found at every lane and street in Chengdu. Such as spicy dan dan noodles, sour and sweet jong's dumplings, and crispy baked egg cake. Chengdu has a museum where visitors can taste many delicacies. Sichuan Cuisine Museum. It is the world's only cuisine-themed experiencing museum. Where people taste delicacies, learn to cook Sichuan food, can enjoy Sichuan opera. Sichuan cuisine, typically hot pot, as well as the wisdom behind it, shines light on the optimistic and inclusive spirit of Chengdu culture. Hello, everyone. My name is An Yi. Welcome to my hometown, Sichuan, the land of plenty. Departing Chengdu, we arrive in Zigong a millennia-old salt capital. Zigong takes pride in its 2,000-year-old salt mining culture. Zigong well salt is a precious ingredient for local cuisine and has fostered yenbang cuisine characterized by heavy taste and diverse flavors. to inherit and promote its salt mining history and culture. Zigong preserves the Shenhai Well, the first man-made well with a depth of more than 1,000 meters in human history. The Zigong Salt Making Industry History Museum is the only of its kind in China. The formation of salt deposits dates back to the geological age when dinosaurs lived in Zigong. The home of dinosaurs is another name card of Zigong. This is a fossil site of mid-Jurassic dinosaurs and other vertebrates. Zigong is also known for lantern shows which creates fantastic visual feasts for global viewers. This is Zigong, a city noted for salt and other flavors.
Hello everyone. My name is An Yi. Welcome to my hometown, Sichuan, the land of plenty. Spring Festival is the most important traditional festival for the Chinese nation. The place is hailed as the birthplace of Spring Festival culture in China. Luo Xiahong, a native of Langzhong, Sichuan Province, was an astronomer in the Western Han Dynasty. He participated in the formulation of the Tai Chu calendar. For this reason, he is called the father of Spring Festival by later generations. On the eve of the Spring Festival, all family members enjoy a reunion feast together, a symbol of good luck and happiness. Jiang Fei beef jerky is a must dish at reunion feasts for Langzhong people. The beef jerky tastes dry, but not too hard. Smooth, but not too soft. It has lasting aftertaste when chewing for a while. Langzhong is embraced by the wandering Jialing River creating a beautiful painting of the city in harmony with mountains and rivers. As Spring Festival draws near, you are welcome to Langzhong, where you can taste Chinese food and experience Chinese festival. Wish people around the world a happy Chinese New Year.